Now that we've created a YouTube playlist, it's time to add videos to the playlist. I'm here in the sample playlist that I just made. I click on the three dots and I click on add videos. Now there are a couple ways to do this. You can either search and find the video if, um, if you know the title of the video. You can use the URL or you can just select from your list of YouTube videos. So let me just show you each way. So recently I made a video called Shifting Your Mindset. So I'm just going to type in Shifting Your Mindset and then I press search. And actually this searches all videos on YouTube. So it might be hard for you to find your own video. Uh, this is much more useful if you're searching a popular video on YouTube that you remember the name of. Um, so as you can see here, if I do the shifting mindset, it's impossible for me to find my own video that has relatively less views than some of these other people. So instead, I would go to your YouTube videos and I would just basically scroll through until I find it. Now, if, if it's, um, hard to find your videos this way, I would recommend going into YouTube studio, which is studio.youtube.com. Okay. And then clicking on the video, the content uh, icon on the left hand side. And once you go there, you can, if you're in YouTube Studio, you're logged into your account, you click on content on the left side, you can use the top search box to search only your own videos. Yes, this top search box only searches the videos from your own channel if you're in YouTube Studio. So let's go ahead and do this. So I'm going to get shifting your mindset. See? There, that's much easier to find my own videos that way. And then what I can do is basically click on the edit button and then copy the video link using this button right on the right hand side. Now, if I go back to uh, my adding a video, I can now use the URL feature and I paste in that URL I copied and yep, that's the video I want. You can also click play if you want to just double In check that it's the correct video and I click on add videos. There we go. I've added one video. Let's try adding another one just to show you what it looks like. Add videos. This time I'm just going to go to my own YouTube videos and here's a cool trick. You can add multiple videos to the playlist. So let's say I'm going to scroll down a little bit here. Let's say I'm going to click on this one. I'm going to add this one for sure. And then I'm going to add another one. Let's say I'm going to click on this one. I can add another one. See if I just, yeah, I, I don't even have to click shift, press shift or command on my keyboard. I simply can, I click on this one first. I click on this one second. I'm going to click on, um, uh, this one third. Okay. So, uh, over commit channel keywords and unpredictable schedule and click add videos notice how it put in the videos based on the order that i clicked even though when i i'll show you again even though when it was in this listing right this one came this one comes first in the list that's more recent than this one which is more recent than this one but when i click them in order it knows to add them in that order so it's pretty cool that um, it's smart enough to do that. And once I have added the videos in here, I can also reorder them by clicking and dragging the two lines on the left, for example, like this. And I can also adjust, uh, I can remove any of these by clicking on the three dots and click on remove from sample playlist. Or I can move to the top, I can move to the bottom. Oh, and um, I, didn't, I never actually realized this. I can set any of the thumbnails as the thumbnail of the playlist, even if it's a, a, a video that's further down. So I, let's say I want it, let's say I like this thumbnail better. I click on the three dots and click on set as playlist thumbnail. It's pretty cool. So, uh, I hope this helps and let's continue on.